including somebody who knows money. So, according to the story, I'm according to the evidence that a proof of charts that was sent to me, uh, the person borrowed from whiskey, 4 million naira went from whiskey was in the ESCC detention, or rather, in the private apartment. Um, the person gave me the money on the, on the 19, 6, 24. The person gave me the money, 4 million naira, for so transfer to this account number 0496411279. Abiola Okunaye, and as you know, from this business name is Okunaye, so I'm frankly, Kuda, Kuda, Kuda one. So, um, apparently, it's his brother's account. So, when it was time to take the money back, according to the story, the guy told me at the end of the year, so, so we obviously needed to. We wanted our money to complete the duty in Lagos. So that was like the only thing. So it's now time to pay. But we still have here, sent him a message. The whiskey refused to respond. Sent him another one after like few days. The whiskey also refused to respond. When the whiskey eventually responded, the whiskey said, um, I'm going to give you the money in, I think, September. So September 1st, the guy reached out to the whiskey again. But the whiskey refused. And the next thing that followed it was blackmail. He said, um, I will tell them that you are smooshing me and you are kissing me. So the guy felt very, very somehow because he felt like he was no way to get his money. Not so kind, the very last man that has the last one to come out to teach me that I want money and I pay. So a friend of mine who is very popular contacted me and he said, We here. See what's going on. And I said, That's very important. You have to see it. Then um, when he sent it, now I'll say something here. When he sent it, immediately I made a video, I first video and I said, well, this time I'm giving you four hours to pay it back. Then he started begging the guy. Now, what I'm going to say now, my lawyer doesn't know. Really now, he started begging the guy. Then he paid. Immediately, he paid. But when I listened to the audio, I said, nah, even though you paid, it has to go the house there. But the FCC cannot go around. Harassing some boys, young boys, and somebody with a godfather will be pulling stops. I was detained in the prison, a very good friend, Show Putin was detained as well. A lot of boys are inside the prison, but this is not any way better than them. So I didn't see any reason why I should keep the audio. I kept the receipt of his payment, which he paid that day. He paid that day. So the I don't think I just smiled. So he was like, really busy. But here's the thing, but we still didn't know that this guy recorded everything. But because of this key, obviously I have the platform here. He understands how I roll. So he quickly did, and I said, no, it has to go there. Now, I need to verify something about Kevin uh, Parano and Parano uh, so far. But apparently right now, some people are taking advantage of uh, what is going on to target Kevin uh, Parano. And uh, I would like to still say here now that I uh, apologize to him for the dance and his name. However, it's so sad that his name was inside that room. I could not believe it as well. That was why I, that was the past that even irritated me more. Which I said, I refuse to believe that I will be past and party to something like that that would make people take somebody out of prison and get a part of So um, here I have a recording. I have one part. I can't give you guys the whole part, but I don't know if you're missing what I did there. So I'll give you one part of it, then maybe you wear another time. I can give you the complete audio. Furthermore, the light I have another one that he was very good about. So I am very, very happy. The reason why I wanted it to be, I wanted to be put the energy to die. So that you understand that Nigeria is not for the Godfathers. Yes, I do that not for the Godfathers. I will not allow for us. If I see the secret about you, or that I will tell. I will tell you that 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 I 
The, the documents are attached to the uh, analysis that I submitted to the house. The operational manual is not there. We can submit that one later. It's okay. Uh -huh. Pages, do you have it? Okay, Mr. Chairman, I have requested for two documents. The first one is the paperwork the day he was admitted, and the second one is a discharge letter the day he was moved from that medium security. And you have an admittance letter when you took him to the maximum. I have all that. Okay, Mr. Chairman, I'm requesting for that as well. And officer, sir. now, don't you think the donation of those chairs would have influenced the movement of Mr. Okunaye from medium to maximum? That was what influenced it, sir. No, don't you think that would have influenced? Because when we talk about corruption, yes, that an inmate donating to the correctional facility. Now, I asked before, you said no, it's not a tradition. But yet you, re you received it and you accepted it. Sir, I want to tell you, I told you. And you wrote, hold on, sir. The chairs even came with his name imprinted on them, correct? You are not the one that received it, sir. I told you that I traveled. Sir, you are representing your institution. <laughs> yes. But I will tell you. Sir, are you, re are you representing your institution? You are old, sir. Be careful. I know. So if you are old, be careful what you say. Do you remember that I said I went for exam on the 21st? After to the first visit, it was there that I was told that this year's came and it was... Sir, are you speaking on your personal capacity or you are speaking on behalf of your institution? I'm speaking, I'm, I'm speaking in my personal capacity as the... So who is going to speak on behalf of your institution, sir? I hope you know why you are here. The, sorry, sir. My controller is here. Okay. All right. So, well, let me let me finish the questions, Mr. Chairman. I've requested I've requested for those documents, and I wish they will be submitted. I want to give back. Thank you very much. I'm a law abiding citizen of Nigeria. If I have the data, I will not appear here on you. You see, one of you. I would like you to help us. You are here to give us evidence. We are here to discuss with you and investigate this matter. What you think, what we think that you better have done wrong might not also be wrong in the eyes of the law. So we need you to speak the truth to us. Finally, are you on suspension? The suspension was a press release. Order, please. Um, I'm not under suspension. And um, please, I think um, I think um, we should uh, stop so far with him. We will get to the issue of suspension because uh, we also have a press release here suspending about uh, three or four of the officers signed by um, the secretary of uh, the secretary of civil defense correction fire immigration board Jafaru Ahmed that's the man that signed it uh, I think he's here too is the secretary here The, so, um, we will get to the issue of suspension and know the reason why they were suspended and also look at uh, the laws. It's within the same range. It's uh, barely two, two, 200 meters from Kerekere Medium to Maxim. So, the offset charge was not on ground. It traveled with my express permission. And 
I'm the, I was the command controller then. Yes. Once it's open, now I'm a little bit. Sir, the urgency. The other officer says for security reasons. You came, you said the urgency. Can you explain to this honorable committee? Define this urgency for us. The urgency, with respect, Mr. Chair, the urgency is that there is a strong story on social media that have attracted the attention of the Controller General. And they have asked me to address that matter. So I, I have to set the transfer and the staff from the here. Trendy, okay. So so the trending story was about the chair. The trending story was, was about the chair. That and were donated. That were donated by his, his relations or friends. Who came the previous the previous day and the chairs in the visitors were not enough. Okay. So so now whenever an officer on duty has to go for another course. Is there nobody that usually takes over from him? Like an assistant? No, there is. There's no problem. So in this case, why did it have to be you to call me and move or risk it with your official operational vehicle? It has to be me because I got directed from my controller general. And in your own assessment, sir, you are an officer. Was there a particular threat at that moment that would have led to the breakdown of law and order? Or people coming in to break into your facility? Because you have still not defined the urgency for us. We want to know because your vehicles moved other inmates to court. You had to rush down there. On your way to that facility, did you meet some group of people trying to vandalize your facility? Because we are trying to understand these urgencies. Uh, just go ahead. You want to tell us? Yes, yes. Okay. The provision of uh, a standing order. Allows the controller to move one of these things. Allows the controller to move. It's within the same range. It's uh, barely two, two, 200 meters from Kerikeri Medium to Maki. So the offside charge was not on ground. It traveled with my express permission. And, and the, I was the command controller there. Yes. Once it's in the same range, sir, the urgency. The other officer says for security reasons. You came, you said the urgency. Can you explain to this honorable committee? Define this urgency for us. The urgency, with respect, Mr. Chair, the urgency is that there's a strong story on social media that have attracted the attention of the Controller General. And they have asked me to address that matter. So I, I have to effect the transfer. And the staff from the here. Trending, okay. So so the trending story was about the chair. The trending story was about the chair. That, that were donated. That were donated by his, his relations or friends. Who came the previous the previous day? And the chairs in the physical system were not enough. Okay. So so now Whenever an officer on duty has to go for another course, is there nobody that usually takes over from him? Like an assistant? No, there, there is. There's no problem. So in this case, why did it have to be you to call me and move or risk it with your official operational vehicle? It has to be me because I got directed from my controller general. And in your own assessment, sir, you are an officer. Was there a particular threat at that moment that would have led to the breakdown of law and order? Or people coming in to break into your facility? 
Because you have still not defined the urgency for us. We want to know because your very